Today, November 9, 2014, marks the 10th anniversary of the killing, actually the murder, of Michael Bell by City of Kenosha, Wisconsin police officer Alberto Gonzalez, which occurred right in front of Bell's mother and sister. It was absolutely murder. Not only did the police lie on their initial reports, but then when they were caught and recaught and recaught, they put a total of six complete different versions of what happened together and were assisted by the attorneys representing the insurance fund for the city. All of those individuals should be criminally charged. Alberto Gonzalez with murder and the other officers and the attorneys with obstruction of justice. Now, in uh, 2012, on November 27th, I personally filed a uh, com criminal complaint allegation with the U.S. Attorney in the Eastern District of Wisconsin and the Federal Bureau of Investigation. Two things have become apparent. First of all, the head of the FBI in Milwaukee was removed from her office for attempting to force uh, an agent to lie in testimony on a different case. Second of all, the U.S. Attorney for the Eastern District of Wisconsin apparently has done nothing or has not communicated that he's doing anything. In the meantime, I've received word that he doesn't want me personally to attend any meetings involving him. Well, let me tell you, I've got more integrity and honesty in my in my in every bone of my body than he has in any place in his body or brain. I don't want to mention his name, but the U.S. Attorney's initials are James Santel. Hey, James, do something or get off the pot. <laughs>